Hey everyone, welcome back to IT Samurai Teacher. My name is Shehab. If your PC has been feeling sluggish lately, it might be because of temporary files, browser cache and junk data clogging up your system. Today, I'm going to show you a simple PowerShell script that can clean up your system in seconds. Let's jump to my script. All right, guys, now here's my script. Now I'm going to explain all these commands because normally when you grab a command from the internet or you try to run a command, you need to have a better understand what you're going to run. So I need to give you a clear explanation about this command and what it does. Now here's the PowerShell script that will clean up temporary files, recycle bin and browser cache. Let's break it down step by step. First, remove temporary files. So what it does? Now, if you go see this red color environment temp and environment local data temp, so these are the default locations where Windows stores temporary files. Normally, if you want to go to this part, what you need to do here is, you go, uh, I mean that part. So let me clear this. You type CD and put that path and boom, you can see it just jump to that temporary folder. And if you type DIR, you will see all this junk file. Now I'm going back again. So that's how you jump to the temporary folder and see the files. Now in here too, you have the local uh, temporary data files. If you want to go, you can go CD and go to that part. Now, as I told you, these are uh, the part to the locations where the Windows stores temporary files. And next we have remove item. So now this command deletes files in these locations. Whatever in these locations, this command will delete it. And we can see in here recurse, dash recurse. So this command ensure it deletes folders and subfolders. And force command removes files without confirmation. And next we have error action silently continue. So now this prevent unnecessary error messages. In short, this command clear out all your temporary files to free up space. All right, now let's jump into the step two, empty the recycle bin, right? So you can see clear recycle bin force, very simple command in here. So what it does, clear recycle bin, uh, permanently delete all the files from the recycle bin and dash force skip the confirmation prompt and deletes everything immediately so once you run this command those deleted files are gone for good remember that so be sure you don't need them because you can't get it back all right now let's jump into the step three our so in this one, we remove browser cache, Microsoft Edge as an example, but you can change to your uh, browser location folder. Now, what does this code do here? You can see Edge cache. So stores the path to Microsoft Edge cache folder. That's the Microsoft Edge cache folder. Next, we have remove items. So this is the path actually, right? And the next one we have remove item path and edge catch, right? Oops, uh, this one. So this is going to delete all catch files inside the folder. And we have recur and force. So ensure all the files and sub subfolders are removed. And we have error action silent continue hide errors if the files are used or missing. So now these steps clear your browser cache, which can help fix slow loading web pages and storage blot. All right, now let's go to the last command we have in here, display a completion message. Now uh, the right host display a message in PowerShell and system clean. So inform the user that the is complete. 
and forge foreground color green makes the text green for visibility so actually this command is a little reward for all your hard work your sister is now fresh and fast so i'm going to run this i'm going to press this button you can see how fast is that just a few seconds and we clean up all the junk files without any third party software how cool is that now bonus tip if you want to do this automated right if you want to automate this stuff just save it as ps.ps1 and schedule it using a task scheduler and put it maybe every day run at eight o'clock nine o'clock maybe at nine or maybe at midnight whatever the uh, time you want to run the task manager will run it and automatically will clean every day and that's it if you found this useful drop a like and subscribe for more tech tips partial tricks and system optimization also let me know in the comments if you want script to automate even more windows cleanup tasks see you in the next one stay secure stay optimized see you